All right, y'all, welcome back to the channel, Matt here. We are back on Red Dead Redemption 2. I know today we are going to continue the story with the John mission. So if you guys can do me a big favor, like the video, comment down below what you guys thought, and of course, subscribe to the channel. It's all a big help. So I don't know what y'all have been into on this series because I know last time we did a murder episode, but I think we can do some great stuff today, and I hope y'all are enjoying it just as much as I am. So without further ado, let's hop into it. Here we go. All right, look at where we are. It is nighttime on the harvest. We're standing right behind the church in the heartlands, and we are actually right behind a cemetery, so that's, uh, that's something. I know that there's a John mission there, but I'm gonna make a serious cut in time to where I can get it to where when we do start the mission, it's going to be daylight out because it's really dark right now and I want you all to see what we're doing, you know? Alright, we are back on the map. I'm not going to search someone else's saddlebag. Uh -oh, mister. So, feeling better? How's the scar? I heal pretty fast. Lucky you. So you just lazing about or you got any leads? I got something. You see them? Sure. Well, you see yourself as a shepherd now? Maybe. Come on. Well, where exactly are we going? Collect something. Help us get some sheep. Uh, you know, that attempt to seem all enigmatic and interesting, that might work for Dutch, but for you, it just makes you look stupid. Come along. You'll see. That train job was a start, but we need more money. Until we can get back to Blackwater and collect. I'm here to tell you. We try to collect that money anytime soon, it'll come with a noose. I was worried you'd say that. Dutch says that we... Dutch says a lot. That's his gift. Saying things. Oh, yeah? What do you mean by that? I was a prize pony once. Now I'm a workhorse. Listen, Dutch is... But... But, well, you was at that thing in Blackwater. We already seen Pinkerton's here. New century's coming. This life, this way, well, we're the last, I reckon. And we ain't long for it. Then that's the way it goes, I guess. For me, yes. All right. So where are we going? Just need to pick up something. There's a hitching post over there. Tether the horse and I'll meet you across the street. I already don't like how this is going. You again? Haven't you done enough already? God damn, everybody hate disrespects my boy Arthur. Good horse. Gun store. Yep. Can you uh head in, pick up the sniper rifle? I'll explain later. Don't you wear yourself out now. Hello. How can I help you today? Looking for a rifle? Something with a sight on it. Eh, yeah, shouldn't be a problem. If you want to see what we've got, it's all in the catalog here. And in there? Wow. Free. Good. 
Sure. Let's go. All right, let's get on our horse, Arthur. Yeah. Why couldn't you have done that? Done what? Bought that gun. Ah, I had a run in with that fella earlier. We ain't on the best of terms. You had a run in. I've had a run in with half that town. Calm down. It's done now, ain't it? Why are you being so cagey about all this? Always playing some goddamn game. Me? I ain't the one taking Jack on fishing trips. No, you ain't. If you say the boy ain't yours, what's the difference? You probably only run off again. Why are you so interested in my life? Ain't you got one of your own? Just do one thing or another. Not be two people at once, that's all I'm saying. It ain't that simple. You know that as well as anyone. Same as with you and that girl... What was her name? Mary? That was different. No, it ain't. Just the same. Anyway, for the love of God, will you tell me what you got me doing here before I turn around and hit the breeze? There's a herd of sheep coming down to auction from Emerald Ranch. Folk in town were saying the owner's trying to stamp out every farm from here to Ansburg. Yeah, I know that place. Say something, John. Come on, man. He wants us to do something with farmland. I don't know what, but... I'm trying to get him to say something if he's going to. Slow it down. Let's head up to the ridge up there. Get a proper view. Be collected on the sale. Doubt the town will care to notice too much. Why we need this rifle you couldn't buy yourself. Reckon we shouldn't get too close. At least not till we know what we're dealing with. Let's see what we can see from up here. John, look at you. I don't know what the hell you're doing. Okay. I think that's them over there. What now? Put a shot in near them. I reckon they'll hightail it. They're only ranch hands. Just watch the sheep. Looks like one of them don't scare too easy. Put another shot in close. He'll get the message. That ought to do it. There he goes. Straight to high tell it. All right. Let's go round him up. Okay, my girl. Let's go get the strays. You ever work on a ranch, Marston? No. You? Oh, day here or there, but not much. Most cowboys I know are dumb as trees. How hard could it be? I guess we'll soon find out. Let's get these things. Bring them back to the yards. Look at us. A couple of ranchers here and there. Who the hell are these two? More men spreading around. Whoa. 
I think we got them all. Let's head for town. You know what? Marston, why don't you leave the sheep to me? You ride Shank, keep watch for any trouble. I brought you in on this. It'll be quicker this way. Trust me. This ain't the right time for you to be learning how to herd. All right, whatever you say. I'm done arguing. Yeah, Arthur. Let's see what we got, boy. Quickest route back to Valentine is right around that mountain. Okay. Like I said, I'll handle this. Here we go. They're running now. Look at them, the tiny little ones. Come on, there you go. Stay on the road, boys. Come on, get out of my way. There you go. There you go, little guys. them are getting separated from the batch. Seen better around here? I've seen ones with less ambiguity about their provenance. <laughs> a lot less. What are you trying to say? I'm trying to say you give me 25% kickback and I won't say nothing to nobody. Everything all right here? Excuse me? Sure. I'll excuse you for 25%. Do you want me to put another hole in your head? Folks swing for rustling livestock. 25%. 15 20. 18. Done. Calm yourself, friend. Just think of it as I'm buying your sins. Uh, you're buying. But we're paying. Go on now. Come back after the auction. You'll get your money. Dutch is waiting for us at the saloon. He is? Oh, Arthur. Thought we was doing the robbing here. Still good money. Well, thanks for all the help with this. <laughs> can't herd, can't swim. Give it a rest, will you? We ain't kids no more. Well, we never really was. All right, let's go into the saloon and meet Dutch. But you know me, we got to hitch our horse right here.
Go on, John, hit your horse. Come on, sunshine. I'll buy you a whiskey. You're talking to me or you're talking to the horse? Not everything, but in the end, I don't believe in absolutes, just shades of gray. Compromise us. Compromise it. Well, I have never... Uh, gentlemen. Dutch, Nepo. Where have you been? Working. Marston's thing. Good. And? We're just waiting to get some pay on a few sheep. Leopold, my good friend, as long as you're here, why don't you and John go make sure there ain't no funny business? Of course. Gentlemen. Drink? Sure. <clears throat> Nothing like talking to old Strauss to make you want to blow your own brains out. I should have left him where I found him all those years ago. Bookish little Austrian, fresh off the boat, his eyes out on stalks. Well, I guess the Dutch Vanderlyn finishing school has some strange graduates. That it does. To your good health. Thank you. Vanderlyn! Get out here! What the now. hell? Vandalin! You don't know me, but you keep robbing me! My name is Leviticus Cornwall. I am not a man to be messed with by the likes of you! Get out here before I have these men killed! What do you think? Get out here, well, I... you depraved piece of trash! You start spinning the yarn, and when I think the moment's you right, I'll make a move. I got where I am by letting scum like you rob from me? Vandalin, you're done! Now get out here now! Deal with this nonsense. Please, gentlemen, this is a terrible mistake. This is a case your mistaken identity. What is worse than admonishing a man for the sins of another? Who wants to be the Messiah? Not me, nor do I want to be this Dutch Vanderlyn, whomever he I am Archibald Smith, a lady preacher. Just a scratch, shut up! 
Come on, Arthur. Hurry, hurry, please. Now's a chance. Come on. Put Strauss on the back of John's horse and let's get out of here. You make sure nobody's following us. We'll get back to camp. We're gonna gather the troops and get them to start packing up. Ugh. Sure. We can't stick around after this. Let's go! <laughs> yeah! On Arthur, ride. Ride like there's nothing you can do. Alright, so I know the second we get back into camp we're going to have a new mission, so I'm going to end the video here, so I hope you guys did enjoy it, you know, like the video, comment down below what you guys thought, and I hope to see y'all in the next one. Peace out.